let me get Mireille Clapeau's reaction to that, because the, on the one hand, there's this bill on Republican values. On the other hand, there's been this commission uh, on France's colonial past. And uh, a, again, if we want to include the, the descendants of, uh, of that colonial heritage, uh, who come from most notably from places like North Africa, um, what needs to be done on that score? Well, I think the main problem we have in France is social discrimination. Uh, you don't have equal opportunities whether you live in a suburb of uh, Paris, uh, Lyon, Marseille, or even Valence, where I live. And if you have an address uh, in, the, in downtown, in the very center of the cities, in principle, you have equal access to, to school, to, uh, to health, uh, to all the public services, but in reality, it's uh, it's um, very difficult, and we are trying to uh, reduce uh, the gap between uh, uh, these people from the suburbs and uh, the educated uh, people. And it's not a problem of uh, whether their parents or grandparents uh, uh, live uh, in Africa or in uh, Algeria. But Carol's point is whether or not they feel as though they belong, that they really are full-fledged French citizens. Well, w when there are some wedding ceremonies, for example, very often they have a flag uh, from uh, the country of their parents of, or, or their grandparents. But if you ask them, do you prefer to live in France or to live in uh, Algeria, uh, uh, Africa? Of course, they say, I feel French. So we have to respect the culture of their parents and grandparents. But to but we have to integrate them um, with the, the social uh, lift and uh, with the, uh, French education and uh, to incorporate uh, them uh, in the Republican uh, values. It's a challenge, I think. It's not so easy, but it has nothing to, s to see with um, religion discrimination, for example. Carol Farrar? So I, I would first, I would just say um, it's really hard to integrate people who are already citizens. Um, a lot of the Muslim youth that I spoke with in France um, would just consistently say, you know, of course I'm French. Of course I I don't know what else I would be if I wasn't French. But I never feel French because people don't, you know, my, my fellow citizens don't see me as being French. And so that's why I think this emphasis on laïcité, which has really become a facade for, um, you know, coercive assimilationist rhetoric, is is really just exacerbating the pro the social problems and the social fractures rather than um, you know finding better ways to teach about a more inclusive national identity and finding ways um, for Muslims also to be representative of of French identity.